guess I should call you a clown. What clown? <laughs> All right, clown of the week for the week September 19 to September 25 goes to our dear Prime Minister, Mrs. Portia oh Simpson God, Miller. No, yes, I'm going there tonight. No, no. I'm going there tonight. You'd like this, damn damn. Have a seat. All right. As we all know, the PNP held their annual conference this past Sunday and Jamaica's Queen-elect, Portia Simpson Miller, gave a most rousing speech. Her eloquent oration inspiring countless Jamaicans across the land. Let's hear a clip of that soul-stirring speech, shall we? Our debt is coming down. Government expenditure as a share of GDP has been reduced. We are doing less with more money. Say, say what now? We are doing less with more money. We are doing less with more money. We are doing less with more money. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> It no, no, seems my. somebody has her wig on a little bit too tight. <laughs> damn, damn. Quiet. Yo, Quiet. Tell her something, please. <laughs> Let's finish. Hold on, hold on. I mean, what else is there to say about this, really? <laughs> <laughs> no, we never think this was a blunder, you know, honestly. But honestly, thing, she was just being honest. This was not a Freud and slip. Yeah, that's right, name, Ari? Yes, that's Freud. Freud. It's not like B-Buddy do it. At least B-Buddy correct himself, yes. right? She even pierces herself and place emphasis on it. But can you hear one more time, please? One more time. We are doing less with more money. We are doing less with more money. <laughs> yep, she's talking the truth. Since assuming office in 2011, the Jamaican dollar has slid from $82 to $113. Therefore, the government is doing less with more money because of the devaluation of the Jamaican dollar. The Jamaican debt has increased to $2 trillion. So what she said makes perfect sense, mm -hmm. don't it? Yeah. Now, I'm not the smartest person in the world, right? As I'm constantly reminded by people who comment on our interview with Karen <laughs> Go watch that, by the way. That's a must Yeah, But I'd like to think that any speech by a prime minister or a president of a country is written by the leader themselves or by them speechwriters and vetted by other departments. Am I right, Eric? That's a, that's like a safe so? assumption. That's a safe assumption, yeah? Mm -hmm. I'd also like to think that the leader spends time reading over the speech several times. Numerous times. Am I wrong for assuming that, You're Eric? not wrong. Okay, so with that being said, please give our Prime Minister, the most honorable Portia Simpson Miller, the loudest clown honks, please. Um, Anything to say, Dom? Um, at this point in time, I am going to say the views expressed <laughs> of Naru is not those or are not those of New Stock 93 FM and our program 96. Naru, for some reason, finds these things amusing. I do not find it amusing. You, you don't? I am of the belief, because I am the, I am the type to give persons the benefit of the doubt. Uh -huh. And I must say, benefit of what doubt? You when, uh, Naro, could you give me a chance to speak? When you are in an area or a room like that, and this is to me now, when you're in such a situation, the place is jam packed. The air is not um, circulating in the, in the so place. So it was the properly. atmosphere. It was the air. It causes us to not speak fluently. Okay. And because of that, the prime minister. Dum Dum is not making any sense. Not no, not one <laughs> iota of sense. I, I must you? say this: her consistency in clonery. it's excellent. Don't draw my tongue. It's nightly fix on News Talk 93 FM. Give it to me, baby. Yeah.